The content on this channel has been created for adults. If you're not at least 13 years of age or older, then please do not watch this content. Sorry, dude. Come back when you're 13. What's up, family? Welcome back to Off Tap Live. I am Faith Chase, aka Prospects, aka Chosen Effect, back on a deck you made wreck the set. And don't you forget, always a pleasure, family. I love you. I hope that you're having a good one. I hope that this moment is a moment that you are living to the fullest, as I love to say, because it is important to do each and every day. Now, guys, we're back for another one. As I told you in a previous video, or might have been a previous, depends when it was uploaded, but earlier on, at some point, there was a Laura Nero song that we did called Eli's Coming. We got to see this amazing prodigy, this eight-year prodigy, as Naughty One called her. Uh, got to see her work and now we get to see another piece of the puzzle here of the equation of the talent that is Laura Nero. This song here is called Save the Country. The naughty one Nora has requested this and left a little shout out for us as well. It says this song is as relevant today as it was when Laura wrote it over 50 years ago. Covered by many and sampled by Kanye. Kanye, really? The glory? I, I was, I was, let's, let's not think about the fact that Kanye probably ruined the song obviously I, I'm very much not going to vote for freaking Kanye West if he is really running for president and I implore everyone out there to think twice before you decide to vote for anybody in particular let alone Kanye freaking West it's like some freaking weird alternate universe with Kanye it can't be really happening perfect song for the save the country lord have mercy couldn't be a more fitting song you got Kanye West saying he's running for president lord have mercy save the country save the country <laughs> save the country Taylor Swift country artist save the country Save Taylor Swift from Kanye West when he freaking did what he did to Taylor Swift at the awards thing. I'll never forget it. It just sticks in my head because I always think, man, what a freaking, you know, a-hole. Beyonce, 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 Beyonce. Shut up. We don't know Beyonce is great. We know she's good. Taylor Swift is too. You don't do what you did though, bro. That was not cool. As an artist myself, if you would have came on my stage and did that to me, oh Lord, have I would have freaked. I'm so, man. Taylor should have smacked the crap out of you. I don't condone violence and stuff, man. But she should have smacked you, dude. You just get off of. My stage, Kanye. <laughs> ah. Oh my gosh, dude. Save the country, Laura Nero. Thank you, Naughty One, for the request. <laughs> ah. All right, guys, let's get into this re request right here. Uh, yeah, I can't wait to hear it. Let's see without further ado for me, for the naughty one, for all of you, except for Kanye. 
Let's get it. We roll in. Amen, 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 a, 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 men, men, men. Seriously, though, yes, absolutely. I see why Nora says it's relevant even to today, you know, like it is. We, we all need to come together, man. We need to save this country. We need to save this planet. It's not just only our country. It's the whole planet everywhere on this earth possibly even the galaxy universe we we still don't know whether or not out there they might have the same issues we have here we don't know we don't know they could have the same problems this could be a universal thing not just a freaking planetary thing on earth it could be everywhere the key is love i say it all the time love is the key hashtag spread love not hate everyone can make a conscious decision to do so this is something that you can make a conscious decision to do so. This is one of the things that actually each and every single one of you on this planet has the ability to make a conscious decision to do. You have the power to create the change. You have the power to make this world a better place. It's not just fancy words and a song. This is something that you can actually truly do. It's a conscious effort. You control your own mind. You have the ability to decide right here and now that you know what? I'm not going to hate anymore. I'm not going to be a freaking horrible, evil, hating person. I'm not going to be a racist. I'm not going to be discriminative. I'm going to start looking at people through different eyes. I'm going to take a moment to be patient and walk in their shoes. I'm going to take a moment to see what their point of view is and respect it. I'm gonna meet them in the middle. I'm gonna be fair and balanced. I'm not gonna be Fox News. What, did I say Fox News? <laughs> I don't know if they're fair, fair or balanced, allegedly. I've heard that they may not be even though they say they are. I would just say it. I heard, allegedly, that Fox, CNN, all the news media out there are spreading fake news. If you ask our president, he'll be the first to tell you so. They're spreading fake news. And you know, even though some of the news might not be fake and some of it might be real, the, the, the bottom line is, why don't we just spread, instead of fake news or news that is just freaking really depressing news or news that might be true, but yeah, like, just who cares? I don't want to hear about it. How about we just spread love? How about we have a news program that's just spreading love. That's just the whole program is a 30 minute, 60 minute love fest of news. In the news today, three cats, three cats. It'll only be animal news probably because animals are only ones constantly, every single day spreading love. So it'd just be animal news. Maybe we just need animal news. Animals are freaking, like I said in another video, they're just, they're just it's just perfectly awesome. I love animals. Even though I'm highly allergic to dogs and cats and I can't have one because, yeah, it could kill me. But but I love them. I've tried to have pets. Story for another day. Add it to the list. It's a growing list of stories for another day. Let's continue.
Thank you. She's saying it. She's preaching it right there. We can build the dream with love. Ah! People in the know know so. People in the know know so. She know. We can build the dream of love. Love is the key. Ladies and gentlemen, love is the key. I say it all the time because it is the facts. A four-lettered word is the solution to the four trillion billion issues going on around the globe. Four letters can solve four billion trillion issues. That's a very pretty, pretty picture of her there, by the way. Um, you know, I, I like the song, and it's it's more than just only about the fact that she is very, very talented. I mean, vocally incredible, and the song itself, you know, you got the acoustic piano and stuff happening. You know, I love that stuff. But I, again, I think it just really brings you back to the message. I, I just, I always love music that has substance. And when you've got a positive message in the song, you know, I'm freaking all in. Ah, I thought we were gonna hit another freaking, uh, you know, blow or something at the end there, dude. That that song just totally just, it just, it was really uplifting. It got to that point where they just freaking took off of it, and it just was just like, and it actually felt like I started feeling like I was in church, man. Like, if y'all ever been to gospel church, and they suddenly get to that part where they're like. And everyone's getting into the spirit and the, the moment they're just like ah. that was the only thing missing from alright oh yeah oh, oh let me hear ya in the morning in the noon hey man hey man hallelujah Glory, 
That's how I was starting to feel. I was feeling that at the end there. It was like, get up and start. Boop, 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 Let's see.